An estimated 11 million pensioner households could be due a one-off payment of up to £600 over the next few weeks to help keep energy bills down this winter. No specific dates have been announced yet for this year's winter fuel payment, WFP, however, Department for Work and Pensions, DWP, online guidance states that most eligible people are paid in November or December. People who are due the annual one-off payment should receive a letter from the DWP telling them how much money to expect. This year's payment will include the pensioner cost of living payment, which is worth either £150 or £300 and means eligible households could receive between £250 and £600 to offset higher energy usage during the colder months. The payments will be made automatically into the same account where the state pension is paid and those who received the WFP last year should receive it again this year unless their circumstances have changed. It's also important to be aware the money can be used in any way to help pensioner households, it's not just for energy bills. It's important to note to be eligible for the winter fuel payment, you must have been born before September 25, 1957 and lived in the UK for at least one day during the week of 18 to September 24, 2023 known as the qualifying week. If you did not meet either of these qualifying criteria, or if you live abroad, you may need to make a claim. If you've had a winter fuel payment before, you do not need to claim again unless you've deferred your state pension or moved abroad, find out more here. Below is an overview of key things you need to know about the winter fuel payment including who needs to claim, who might not qualify and how much to expect, full details can be found on Gov. UK here. Who does not need to make a claim? You do not need to claim if you get any of the following, state pension pension credit attendance allowance personal independence payment, PIP. Carer's Allowance Disability Living Allowance DLA, Income Support Income Related Employment and Support Allowance ESA, Income Based Job Seekers Allowance JSA, Awards from the War Pension Scheme Industrial Injuries Disablement Benefit Incapacity Benefit Industrial Death Benefit How to Make a Claim You Can Claim Winter Fuel Payment by Post or Over the Phone Claim by post fill in a winter fuel payment claim form for UK residents and send it to the winter fuel payment centre, the form and address details are on Gov. UK here. Claim over the phone contact the winter fuel payment centre on 0800 731 0160, lines are open Monday to Friday from 8am to 6pm. Before making the call have your national insurance number, bank or building society details and the date you were married or entered into a civil partnership, if appropriate, to hand. How much you will be paid any money you get is tax free and will not affect your other benefits. If you live alone or no one you live with is eligible for the winter fuel payment you will get either. £500 if you were born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957, aged between 66 and 79, £600 if you were born before September 25, 1943, aged 80 and over, if you live with someone else who's eligible for the winter fuel payment your payment may be different if you get one of the following benefits, pension credit income based job seekers allowance, JSA, income related employment and support allowance, ESA, income support if you do not get any of the benefits listed above you will get a payment of either. £250 if you and the person you live with were both born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957 £250 if you were born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957 but the person you live with was born
born before September 25, 1943 350 pounds if you were born before September 25, 1943 but the person you live with was born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957 300 pounds if you and the person you live with were both born before September 25, 1943 if you and your partner jointly claim any of the benefits listed above one of you will get a payment of either £500 if both of you were born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957, aged between 66 and 79, £600 if one or both of you were born before September 25, 1943, aged 80 and over, if you get any of the benefits listed above not as part of a joint claim, you will get a payment of either, £500 if you were born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957, aged between 66 and 79, £600 if you were born before September 25, 1943, aged 80 and over, if you live in a care home if you are eligible you will get either, £250 if you were born between September 25, 1943 and September 24, 1957 £300 if you were born before September 25, 1943 Eligibility If you live in a care home you can get winter fuel payment if you live in a care home. You will not be eligible if both of the following apply. You get pension credit, income support, income-based job seekers allowance, JSA, or income-related employment and support allowance, ESA. You lived in a care home for the whole time from 26 June to September 24, 2023. Get the latest record money news. Join the conversation on our Money Saving Scotland Facebook group for energy and money saving tips, the latest benefits news, consumer help and advice on coping with the cost of living crisis. Sign up to our Record Money newsletter and get the top stories sent to your inbox daily from Monday to Friday, including a special cost of living edition on a Thursday. Sign up here. You can also follow us on X, formerly Twitter, at Record Money underscore for regular updates throughout the day. Who is not eligible for winter fuel payments 2023-24? You will not be eligible if you, have been in hospital getting free treatment for more than a year need permission to enter the UK and your granted leave says you cannot claim public funds were in prison for the whole of the week of 18 to September 24, 2023 you can read the full guide to this year's winter fuel payment on Gov. UK here. Join the Daily Records WhatsApp community here and get the latest news sent straight to your messages, 